Hello YouTube. Um, I am in my kitchen. New territory for you. Um, and I am cooking some stuff. Um, this isn't a cooking video, by the way. Um, but this happened to be cooking, and I also happened to be thinking at the same time. So I figured, eh, why not do them at the same time? Hold on. So I've been uh, I've been seeing a few YouTubers, a few of the big ones, um, using some tool, or some device. I don't remember what it's called. Called I think Patreon or Patreon or something like that. Um, I just watched Thunderfoot's latest video, and yeah, he talks about that. Right, he talks about setting one up for himself, and he hooks it in this whole all sorts of rhetoric about you know fighting. I don't know, fighting pseudoscience, and you know to the barricades again. Right. Um, it's not my style. <laughs> now I haven't opened an account for this this website. And I, I think the reason why is that I, I feel weird about about the idea of it, right? On the one hand, I'm extremely like a big supporter of things like Kickstarter, right? Um, I'm sort of vaguely a musician, and so have have an interest in the way that the music industry works, and I find that um, that Kickstarter is a really cool tool. I think I was really excited when I first heard about it right it's just a really interesting change in business model it takes power away from centralized record labels and stuff like that which is which is all great i'm happy with it um also there are a lot of artists who i know who now just have the capacity to be sort of a perpetual motion machine with their fans think of even someone like amanda palmer which is cool um and so so that kind of that kind of business modeling is is you know I like it I, I really do um, but at the same time I feel like isn't there a social contract here right isn't there a social contract between me and uh, the people who view my YouTube channel um, some of them you know, I don't have that many subscribers, 450, something like that. Love every one of you. Actually, I'm sure some of you are pricks. I just don't know which ones they are. I'll find out, though. Um, but I do have, I do have some, some subscribers who are particularly, like, who really get, who apparently at least, really get something out of my channel. They really for some reason enjoy the, you know, what I do um, and I think that there's a there's a there's a, a social relation there right and I feel that there's something extremely weird about about monetizing that right commodifying it and that's what I'm sort of nervous about with with the idea of whatever the fuck it's called let me see. Patreon? Patron? I feel like my mom. My mom always. Yeah, can't remember. Remember the names of things. And she, like, stumbles over. I don't know. Fuck it. I'll just call it Patron for now. But the idea of it is just. I guess I upload a video. And then some, like, you know, for every video I upload, some amount of money, be it 10 cents or whatever, um, some amount of money goes from the viewer to me in fucking some way. I don't know. I really should do my research. Um, but it isn't terribly important that I do my research because you know, before I even think about doing my research, before I even think about taking that idea seriously, um, 
I, I guess I just want to ask my subscribers, right? Um, I haven't set up any mode of having, you know, any form of voluntary donations or something. Oh, let me let me frame it. Let me backtrack because I feel like <laughs> I feel like I should explain a little more. Um, I make my YouTube videos on a really shitty laptop. Um, and just on the webcam that I have on here. Um, I don't have a microphone, right? I don't have a camera <laughs> uh, that's, like, good, right? I don't have good quality anything. I don't really have video software besides the shit that comes with, with my PC. Um, I guess I could pirate software, but... <laughs> Bless myself, I guess. Um, and so, as a result, like, I find myself sometimes when I make YouTube videos, I'm like, you know, like, it would be really cool if I could, like, just fucking have a camera, right? And, like, have a microphone and stuff. And I think about, you know, what if I buy it? You know, what if I buy some item? fact is, like at the moment I work just in a restaurant, right, I don't have some tremendous income, it's just not, in some way it's not financially feasible for me to be, begin thinking about like investing some amount of capital, so I'm sort of stuck behind between a rock and a hard place, like on the one hand, like I, I would like to make videos where you can hear what I'm saying, right? <laughs> would like to I would like I do occasionally I like to cut together videos and make proper YouTube videos right make it make an argument <laughs> um, and people seem to be receptive to that kind of thing but I feel like I don't know I'd like to be able to do all that stuff better but the only thing that stops me is just fucking money, it's just fucking financial, financial issues. And so, I don't know, I feel like I should talk to you guys, right? Inquire to my subscriber base about whether or not that's something that would be, you know, I don't want to be panhandling or something or asking for handouts or, or any of that stuff, of course, um, I think there's a fight on the horizon coming with the quantum idealists, um, their movement is getting bigger and bigger, and it would be fun if I could actually make videos that are good quality uh, against them. I don't know. So yeah, I I have fun doing this, and I am limited only by the amount of income that I make. So do you think it's appropriate for me to set up such an account? You know, something like I upload a video, ten cents, ten cents goes from an audience member to me, and then in theory I can take all that money and fucking you know, buy a camera or something like that. Um, I think if I were to set up an account, I would probably um, I'd probably make if I were to set up a patron account, I would set up a a second YouTube channel um, because I feel like I make videos like this where I just fucking ramble into a, a camera and I'd feel terrible. <laughs> If somebody pay, if somebody was paying for this, all right. So like, you know, I'd look. I guess I'd reserve this channel for more stuff like the apologetics is ideology stuff and and etc. Right, those kinds of videos. Um, that's probably how I do it. I don't know. Is that a bad idea? My, is, that a, is that a selling out idea? Am I entertaining selling out somehow? 
Or am I entertaining being uh, being an internet panhandler? Some such nonsense. I don't know. So you tell me. Leave a comment. Tell me. Tell me if what I'm thinking about is is inappropriate or somehow violates this relationship. Because I don't want to violate this relationship. I I I value this relationship. And yeah. Have a good day.